Tyler Harley here. I'm just going to show you my favorite plant. Uh, here's a purebred Arctic fern. A little backstory on what we call it an Arctic fern, mainly for the coating along this, the frosting, actually like a frosted flake on the plant. Brandon Hartley here. What you got here is your classic pink evergreen. Um, unlike most evergreens, this one actually doesn't last during the winter. Well, actually I shouldn't say that. It's lasted before for me, but 75-80% um, of the time this thing's going to die during the winter. This plant requires as much sun exposure as possible, so what we've done is we've just built this mound of dirt up as high as possible just to get it as close to the sun as possible. You know, we want to get a lot of rays on this. I used about five bags of black soil. You can use 10, 20, maybe even 40 if you wanted to, and it's only going to make it grow even faster. I dug my hole. Uh, as you can see, I made mine about a foot and a half deep. I wouldn't go any shower than that. Gonna want to leave this a lot of room to grow, so we'll just put our flower in right now. Oh, wow. Just a light mist. This one loves water just as much as it loves sun. I recommend about four or five hours watering a day. Keeps it growing nice and healthy all summer long. Brendan? One of the great things about the pink evergreen is that you only got to water it once. You just fill your hole up once a summer and uh, let nature do the rest. Because, <laughs> I mean, let's be honest, who's got the time to water their plants every day? So, it will drown probably 50% of the time, but, you know, such is life. 